I finished building this, <laughs> but it's based on an older tutorial and uh, it's not working anymore. So I had to put these in, the glass on the corners, right? And I actually have to take the glass out if I want the villagers to start reading. Also, I can have the stone around here. Those villagers in here, they were supposed to be stacked, right? And then grow up and keep staying stacked. But the problem is when they grow up, this happens. They go over into the wall. And while they're in the wall, uh, they can walk out. Like this guy just walked out. And that guy was suffocating for a bit. Uh, my zombie died. I had, I had to bring another one. But I still named him Zombie Fire 3000. Anyways, yeah, I don't know. I I kind of need to make the villagers one by one for this to work. I think that's. Anyway, this is just like the first design, I guess, based off an old tutorial. I'm uh, probably gonna change it at some point. Um. I'll make my own basically and I'll use the fact that um, those those little guys uh, the kids hello uh, Mr. Zomatic I'll use the fact that the kids walk through a one block space and then put a trapdoor so they fall in um, I don't know you're the first one who messaged so I think not not yet I just started anyway, maybe they'll show up. But yeah, I'm kind of waiting to see what happens when the next one grows up, so... <laughs> that's what I'm most interested in right now, I don't know how long it's gonna take. I should be giving them some food maybe or something. But yeah, I used to have this problem with them... Uh, those two guys here, they were sleeping. And when they would wake up, they would go... Oh, I also need to take this out. They would wake up on different, like, blocks or on top of the beds and walk out. And this fixes it. Like, if they sleep now, when they woke up, wake up, they go back in the middle. But this guy here is a problem. I don't even know... My, um... My minecart here is not gonna pick up any of them. Oh, it did. Okay, I guess so that, that kind of worked. I should bring another. Oh, nice. Uh, what kind of villager breeder do you have? I mean, is it like automatic or something? I need... Oh. Hmm. It depends on how much... The fun parts? What are the fun parts? Alright, where's... I don't have it. Oh, there, there's some boats here. <sighs> Alright, so... I want some boats around here. For when that guy grows up and that one is gonna run away. Also, if he stays there, the cart is not gonna pick him up. Oh, god damn it. Yeah, it's like what I did yesterday, basically. Uh, I don't know, I need... I, I complicated things with this. I, I should have made it simpler, like with more space in between. And, you know, probably different kind of rail setup, maybe. Oh, there he is. Hey, Crawford. Mr. Zomatic was asking about you earlier. Alright, well... Ah... Uh, <laughs> it's kind of funny seeing this guy being dragged from side to side. I think I'm gonna go for a polar bear, because... Oh man, <laughs> good luck then, indeed.
Oh, all right, this guy grew up. So I can turn this guy into a zombie. Oh, I, I know what to do in the meantime. Um, I need to make like an alchemy uh, room or something somewhere. I want to give it some space. I'll make it here. So one, two, three, four. Right, and I'll, I'll make it like this. Uh, <laughs> actually, like you might think, I'm happy I finished school, but I kind of miss it. Uh, so you know, while you're in school, you're all like, "This is awful," but after you finish school, you're <laughs> you're starting to think like, "Man, I miss school," right? It really depends. It really depends on how school is for you. But for me, like when I was in school, I was like, fuck this, this is awful. And then, uh, you know, you go to college or whatever and you're like, oh god, this is so much worse. Alright, so here we go. Those guys went to sleep, right, up there. And now I can sleep, I mean not yet, but I'll be able to sleep soon. So at least the guy down there didn't go to sleep as well. Well, I'm gonna be honest, I almost never did my homework. I mean, it depends on your teachers and everything, but <laughs> for me in school, I, I used to do most of my homework in, um, what's it called? In the breaks right between between classes I'd have a 10 minute break and I would like work on my homework in those 10 minutes and do whatever I could some of it was doable and some wasn't most of the time I, I'd come out okay I I rarely did my homework at home and went fully prepared back to school uh, I usually just try to learn like I, I didn't really learn in my free time I used to learn everything in school I paid attention in class and did my homework in the breaks and that got me through yeah no problem see you, man I don't even know what sixth form is. <laughs> all right, all right. So let's get back to work. I'm uh, building this here. I guess it needs a roof. I'll make it three high, like this. Wait, that means the roof is gonna be even higher. Right, this is kind of a weird thing I'm building, but who cares? No! And of course I need more building blocks. Alright, so other than building blocks, like stone, I don't know why I ended up making everything out of stone, but it is what it is. Alright, so I want to make, or rather, do I want to make, god, I need... Do I have any empty shulker boxes? Ah, fuck. I I filled up my shulker boxes with useless stuff. Alright, let's empty this one. Uh, and now I don't really have any to work with. Oh, wow. It's like college. Nah, Romanian education is pretty simple, I think. You just have like, um, I don't know what the first one is called, grade school, whatever, like the regular, <laughs> regular school, high school, and then college, right? Or university, whatever. 
Oh, congrats, man, on your 5k. All right, so I got some stone and I got this. Let's, uh, let's bring alchemy, elementary, primary, and high school, and then college, I suppose. Like, what's, it, what's the difference between college and university, by the way? Because i kind of been calling it the same thing. Yeah, I was thinking about streaming League yesterday, but I didn't feel like it. I usually, I don't know, I kind of enjoy my quiet League time. Anyway, so like, by how you explained it, you have like extra school. <laughs> well, like, it sounds like extra school, that uh, sixth form thing. The advanced exams or whatever. Elementary, middle, and high school, then college. Oh, sixth form instead of college. All right, so what do I want to get out out of this? The mushrooms, spider eyes, the apples, the mama cream, the blaze powder. Uh, all right, I need some sugar as well. Glowstone, redstone. Do I need gold nuggets? I don't think so. Oh, the nether warts. Glass bottles. Alright. Well, this... <laughs> This whole education discussion is kind of beyond me. I uh, I gave up on college or university, whatever. I think there's the same thing. Like the one after high school. After one year and a half, I, I, was, I wasn't really attending, so I just gave up completely. It felt pointless, pointless to keep going if I'm not attending the classes. All right, all right. Well, yeah, that's that's why I keep saying it's the same thing, but you know, maybe in other places it's not really the same thing. All right, so what else do I need? I got a bunch of shit for alchemy. I need brewing stands. How do you make those? All right, cobblestone. Where do I have some cobblestone? Of course, nowhere. I ain't got no cobblestone around. Alright, alright. What else do I need? Oh, I was looking for cobblestone. All right, let's turn some of this into cobblestone. How many brewing stands do I want? I think three are enough. So I need nine pieces of uh, cobblestone. Well, I would have been destined for greatness if I wasn't this lazy. I I can't bring myself to do some like s s simple buildings in Minecraft. All right, all right. So ah, I need these. So brewing stand, three of those. Let's go. Uh, should I even make a cauldron, or is it pointless? I do need water, so I need some buckets, and I want to make a bit more glass bottles. Alright, so I, I pretty much got what I need for making um, the potion of weakness. Yeah, let's just take this. Uh, 
uh, you were like joking about me being destined for greatness and stuff, but I, I feel like school was easy for me. I wasn't really uh, like committed to it and I still passed it fine, right? Like I went through most of my... I, I would say I was above average without even trying, right? But I don't know, there may be just be... <laughs> there may just be a lot of dumb people in, in the world, you know, like... <laughs> Picture, picture me, young me, being like, oh my god, I'm surrounded by idiots. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, um... Okay, never mind, not here, over here. That, why isn't this guy growing up, though? He should be growing up soon. And I'm pretty sure he's gonna escape. <laughs> I mean, those are facts, okay? Uh, I don't know. I do. I do think of myself as stupid, but at the same time, you know, I know there's a lot of dumb people out there, so <laughs> I can't really just like be super hard on myself like that when I've got others examples, other examples. Anyway, like all those people who come in the stream and tell you. You know, yeah, I'll give you a hundred dollars if you kill yourself. Those kinds of people, man. They're the worst. Just let people play. Like, the only... Uh, the only people that shit works on are kids, right? So... Like, oh god. Imagine you're a kid, right? You're trying to stream. You're like 10 years old or whatever. Do, do 10 years old even... Even it, like, is it too complicated for a 10 year old to stream? I don't know, but imagine they're like, uh, really young and, uh, trying to stream and some guy comes in and he's like, oh, I'm going to give you money if you kill yourself or whatever. And they, they get all excited and do it. And that guy's like, haha, you got trolled, right? What happens to that kid? Like how, how it impacts his development you know he's gonna have trust issues for life I, I don't, that's what I'm talking about here he's gonna get scarred I think something must have happened to me that I don't I don't trust people something like that only uh, in another medium it wasn't in streaming Oh god, Mr. Beast. I mean, I think he's trustworthy because that's his thing, right? But I'm not sure. I, I guess I would. I mean, even if I wouldn't want to do it, my brother would just come in and, you know, take me away from my computer and do it himself. <laughs> so. What do you mean, putting a period? Oh, Mr. Dot Beast, <laughs> he thought it was a link. All right, all right, let's put these in. Oh God, all right, we're using just two then. I need chests, I need to get some chests. Of course, I forgot something. Yeah, I got that shit for the spam bots. So sorry, people won't be able to post post links and stuff. Although I don't mind it. I I really don't want to check a lot of links while on stream, especially because of the audio and stuff. And like I said, a lot of trolls. What am I even doing? Why do I open like 20 chests each time when I'm I know what I'm looking for? I just don't concentrate on it. I talk about something else. And it takes me forever to get to the chest I want. Alright. 16 chests. Way more than I needed. But. That's just how I roll. <laughs> Alright. Let's put those in here. What? Was I hearing a skeleton? Alright, that guy's not growing up. I don't know what the fuck is happening. 
Okay, so over here in the chest, right? Ah, oh, God, why do I keep this trash on me? I mean, I guess I know I keep some of it. Oh, I also need the water source. Right, but uh, would this work? Like, fuck, I almost picked that shit back up. If I if I get a, a water source block and I put it in there, can I get glass water bottles out of it permanently, or is it gonna drain out? Like if it's a cauldron. All right. Okay. Never mind then. <laughs> so we got the water, the glass. All right. All of this stuff. I'm gonna put the apples over here. Oh God. I need one. Hello. I need one uh, crafting table as well. All right, so keeping things sort of separated, right? The magma cream, right? The, the <laughs> dust thing. Where's the sugar? I didn't pick up the sugar. All right. So what else? Was this it? I think it's it's mostly yeah let's get a crafting table as well of course I have to god I need to I don't know this is annoying having to fly over every time I need to get a better system for getting around but I think this is it right like this is the fastest way to get around in Minecraft you just fly from one place to another Come on. Okay. Let's go back. If I wouldn't fail, just like. Okay. Oh, never mind. I thought for a second the other one grew up. Oh, God. Come on. I want that guy to grow up. Alright, so. Uh, I, I want the crafting table so I can make the golden apples, right? Oh, and I need a shit ton of gold as well. Let's go get gold. And obviously these resources I'm putting down there aren't going to last me for too long. But eventually I'll um, I'll stock up some more stuff. Come on. Why can't I right click to fly? What's happening? I jumped like three times and I couldn't uh, fire rocket or whatever it's called. Firework rocket. Couldn't use it. All right. Okay, there we go. That guy grew up and he's dying. That's unfortunate. Problem is, this other guy isn't dying. He's, he's just stuck there. And uh, I think I kind of have to kill him. But I don't know. Alright. Let me try something. Is this going to kill him? Or... Oh, I can't place the block because... Because he's there. I'm trying to place a block that would suffocate him ah right of course uh, well I have to get that guy out of there <laughs> well it is unfortunate <laughs> and when you put it into perspective like that it's also kind of funny like uh, I I thought of myself doing that and I started laughing all right, so I got the golden apples here. I got the shit for the potions over on this side. All right, so okay, let's let's do it then. One golden apple, couple of splash potion of weakness. All right, so water bottles right we stack them up in here I forgot how you do the potion brilliant it's just like me to forget uh, I know I needed the fermented spider eye and is it on a nether wart where was the nether wart 
was the nether wart for the fire resistant potion or was it for the all right let me let me google it real quick because i need to remember uh weakness potion in minecraft let's go all right fermented eye only i mean that's what showed up uh, and that's good because I, I don't really have a nether wart uh, farm or anything. Alright, so one and one and one, right? And then we put this in there and then one gunpowder. And once that's done, do the gunpowder. Alright, so that's gonna give me the splash potion of weakness. I'm gonna. Uh, I don't know what to do with this guy. I really don't know. For now, let's just move him. The thing is, I wanna kill that guy that's uh, making my whole operation uh, not work, right? The one in there. But if I do kill him. The others are gonna be pretty upset, right? How do I make that guy die? Without... Um, I have a, an idea for maybe like... What if I put some water... Inside there somewhere? Let's try it out. If I try to put water... Oh! I wasn't... Fuck. Of course I fucked something else. All right. Hmm. How do I kill that guy without upsetting the others? How do you kill villagers without upsetting the others? I could potentially do some lava. Hmm. All right. All right. Let's go. A bit higher up and try again with the water I need to put the water down under the all right all right on the glass there all right that that made him float a little bit and now I can't get the water back for some reason fuck I want my water back it would have been uh, a bit more awkward if it was uh, lava, honestly. Well, technically, I said it before you wrote it, I think, because there's a big delay, but... Yeah, we, we both said it at the same time, kind of. I would imagine. Alright, how do I get this water back? Could just break the glass and take it real fast. Alright. If I stay here. Okay, whatever, it's fine. Um Fuck my life. I I hate everything. Okay. I'm gonna kill him. Alright. I got to put all of that shit back together, man. Mm. Uh, I I don't know what to say about the like zombie spawners and stuff. I I'm not a huge fan of the mobs going around aesthetic, but I I have a really made it so like like maybe if i made one of those spawners like you said at the surface maybe then i would f appreciate it more once i actually saw it uh, okay so what else have i fucked up this goes like this this one here the button all right I 
I think that's... I don't know why that's a powered rail. Oh, because I can button... Alright, I know that why that's a power rail. Okay, so... How was this... Then... Going like this? Why do I have 64 rails on me? No, it wasn't like... Like this. It was like this... And like that. Uh, Alright, I have two power rails on me and one... Fuck! One should be... Nope, not water. One should be here and the other one should be here. Like that. I think I fixed it. I'm not entirely sure. Alright, so... Even if that guy is upset with me, he'll probably forgive me, right? Alright, now we click this button. And that guy's getting zombified. Oh, my bad. Sorry, Mr. Zombie, didn't mean to interrupt your. Alright, and then I take a splash potion of weakness. I click this button. I did not click that button. I fucking hate my life. I have to fix that now. I have to... I have to make the zombie go back up here. Ah, fuck! Okay. Okay, screw this. I'm going... I'm going after a polar bear. I don't... I don't care anymore. I'll fix this off stream. <laughs> Because it's such a pain to deal with, fucking waiting for the night and shit. Oh my god. Man, you know how hard it was for me to get that single zombie up in there? Because the other one I had, I accidentally burned and I had to bring another one. And I had to figure out how to put him inside there. And now I just went and did that. Right, so never hold my pickaxe while I try to press a button. That's the first rule of Minecraft. <laughs> it's not the first rule of Minecraft, but whatever. Anyway, let's um, let's go look for. Um, I was gonna say panda bear, but I mean polar bear. Let's find the polar bear. Oh my God! This guy just teleported in. Bringing me orange dye. Oh, cactus. Ah, fuck. Get, get out of here. Let me kill you. All right. Okay. Let's go for a polar bear. So, I got boats, and I don't know if I need anything else. Let me let me grab some some food. Uh, because I'm running low on the gold carrots. I feel like I haven't done anything interesting in a while. In Minecraft. Mostly because I, I don't really feel like playing, so... What ends up happening is... I just <laughs> waste a bit of time, just so I can say I've streamed for the day. And then I go into League Solo Queue. But soon that will be on stream as well. Alright. Let's... Fly over to the ice biome, I guess. The frozen ocean, whatever. How strong are polar bears? That's my question. Like, how hard does a polar bear fuck me up if I try to get in a boat with it? Also, can you get adult polar bears in a boat? Anyway, well, we're about to find out. I'm gonna tell you. Right now, if I uh, if I die here to a polar bear, I'm not even gonna be upset about it. All right, there we go. We have some uh, some polar bears. So first of all, are they aggressive? Will they come and fuck me up? Hello, hello. 
Oh fuck. Oh god, never mind. That scared the shit out of me. Oh god. Oh my god. Alright, alright. Fuck off, fuck off. He really wants me. I, I Should I let... Should I let him hit me once to see the damage? I'm so afraid. Oh! He did no damage! Oh my god. Alright, so he's really weak. Okay. Also... It's just... Sucks for you, man. <laughs> that you had to be aggressive. If, if you were cool, I'd be cool. Alright. That was... Huh. That was interesting. Okay, so we got the baby bear. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Success! Alright. Ha! <laughs> uh, can you put a lead on them? On the tiny polar bears. Well... We'll find out. Oh, he's so cute. He's he's kind of long. For <laughs> for some reason, he's pretty long. Ah, oh, his his little breathing noise. And look at his his tiny face. You can see it, but you can see his like snout or whatever it's called. Oh, look at it! It's so cute. Oh, he's looking this way now. Come on. Up, look up so I can see your face. He is kind of cute. Oh, look at him. Oh, I should name tag him, by the way. Uh, should name tag him so I don't ever lose him. Alright, you wait here. And please, please don't despawn. Oh, he's so cute. Alright, let's get the name tag. Oh. Don't know if I have any emeralds, but I can easily get some. Yeah, he is actually. I don't know. I like his face. It's kind of cute. Minecraft polar bears are cute. All right, all right. So, but they're kind of long. <laughs> I don't know if they look like a caterpillar or something. Uh, wait, not here. All right. So, what do we name him? I'm gonna name him Guardian because that's what I want him to be a guardian. All right. And actually, let me check. Can I? Uh, oh, can I do this? Oh, perfect. Oh, he even. Came out of the boat. Alright. Guardian. Nice. Let's go. Did he do a little sound effect? Like... He made some noise. Like different than his breathing. Anyways. Uh, let's, let's take him to the Hall of Rewards. Come on. Oh, look at his feet. Oh my god. Look at him pedaling. It's so cute when he walks. He's like... Tick, tick, tick. Look at it. <laughs> His little feet trying to keep up with me. Oh, he went on the bed as well. Alright, alright. Look at him, he's just lovely. I didn't think I would enjoy the polar bear in Minecraft so much. But he is long though, look at him. He's got... Why does he have like a big butt? <laughs> you know, couldn't it have been just one block? Because he's got the head, then he's got the chest that's smaller and then such a big butt. Maybe they sh should have made the butt smaller than the chest or something. Alright, the thing is, I can't make him stay. And I can't tame him, right? So once he grows up, he's gonna be aggressive. I imagine. I know I had some white glass. In some chest. Do you see it? Oh, there's just two blocks. Alright. Let's go through the stairs. Come on. P 
put him in a class box for all to really kill him. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? That is gonna be the guardian of the Hall of Rewards. And if anybody dares... Uh, if anybody dares to attempt something in the Hall of Rewards, he's gonna be released upon them. What the fuck was that noise? Did he take damage? Did you fell down the stairs? Alright, come in here. Just Alright, we're pushing him in. Okay, stay there, stay there. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna leave him that, because he needs some breathing space and I don't have any glass on me. But, alright, now that's done. I can see his name though. Maybe once he grows up, he's gonna be big enough for me to see his name. Oh god, he looks so sad. I think he's crying. That's what that noise is. He's actually crying. He's not, he's not just a mere display. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking make an... And uh, like door mechanism that lets him out so he's a, an actual threat for he who dares enter the hall of rewards with uh, ill intent all right all right I'm sorry you look kind of sad <sighs> but we did get the polar bear which is nice I think he's crying for his parent, man. Those those tiny cries you hear. He just misses his his mama. Ah shit. Nah, if I do that he just jumps out. I need to wait for him to grow and I wanna take those two blocks and cover that up there and you know leave the space. Mm. But yeah, I need him to grow up. Can I feed him some fish or something maybe? Well, I don't think they're not tameable there the only way to get polar bears is if you kidnap their young right because the big ones are just angry at you and try to kill you I mean you could take a big one as well probably all right so I don't know what else to do I, I didn't have any plans all right let's I know what to do let's get all the quartz I have and keep working on the hall of rewards while he grows up I want to be around for his uh, <laughs> development also I, I should make uh, a lot of golden apples and fix the, these guys alright where's my quartz yeah let's let's go so how many are there one two three four five s this guy is <laughs> this guy has armor, dude. What the fuck? All right, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six guys. Let's make six golden apples and cure those guys, and then I'll fix this off stream. Oh, also, I can probably stop that. Yeah, I need to. F Do I need to fix this, by the way, or is it just gonna work like that? Like if I bring a Pretty sure it's gonna work. As long as that guy doesn't get in the cart or something. I, w I will fix it anyway. Alright, so let's do, like I said, five golden apples. I already have one. Oh, this way. Alright. God damn it. I was like, why do I have extra gold? But <laughs> I forgot about that. Okay, and one splash potion of weakness I'm hoping is enough. To finally cure those guys. They've been zombies for a while. I hope they don't have any permanent brain damage. Alright, if I do it right in the middle, do I get all of them? I. I won't. 
Oh my god, did I get none of them? Alright, I got those two. Uh, man, uh, that was a horrible throw. I didn't expect it to be that bad. Oh, I realized too late I'm gonna hit the wall. Alright, so one splash potion of weakness and then another. Wait, why do I have three? Did I miscount? Oh yeah, I needed six and I made only four and I had one, so I ended up with five instead of six golden apples. Oh god, everything is so complicated. Where's my... F never mind. I forgot what I needed to fly. Okay, okay, so those two guys in the middle are fine. And then these two guys and the other two. Alright. I guess we're having cured villagers. You know what? If I could understand how these guys were all turned into zombies because this is a pretty good system like mm, if if i let's say i have all my villagers in a row like this right the way the stonemasons are if i make a sort of track oh i i, I have an idea so what happens mm, all right, all right. Uh, I need to try something. So, I'm thinking. I need some slabs to check out. But no, that's not gonna work. Ah, fuck. Or maybe, maybe it is. All right, all right. So. Ah, oh god. I made too many. Too many slabs, obviously. What the fuck happened? I started flying randomly. Alright, so I'm thinking, keep all my villagers in a row like that, put those here so they can't get out, right, and then make a track under, like that, that guy can't get out, right, if I put tracks down here with a zombie in a minecart, and it goes like that, back and forth, and I can stop it wherever I want, right? To make one of those into a zombie. That would be, that would be kind of good. Anyway, let's take these down for now. All right, so this guy turned back to normal. What's he giving me a discount on? Oh, I can trade stone. If I cure him a bit more, I am gonna be able to trade one stone for one emerald. The other one in the middle, this guy should be soon done as well. Alright, there we go. The brown glazed terracotta one. Oh, this guy had stone as well. Anyways, um, I should sleep and head inside soon. Ah. Uh, I think I might even miss the polar bear growing up because I spent time curing those assholes. Come on, can I sleep? Not yet, I guess. Let's see how Guardian's doing. Oh, he's still a baby. Let's see if he changes overnight. Look at his cute butt crack. Oh, that's a tail. Never mind. <laughs> it's not just his butt crack, he has a tiny tail. Is it a tail? Like one of those fluffy tails like the the rabbits have. Alright, alright. I'm a bit worried about his heavy breathing, but should be fine. 
Okay, so in order to do more more of this quartz work here, what would I need? Let's say I've I've ended up Oh god, I should fix some of the floor. Do I have any quartz slabs around here left? Uh, oh, there's my white glass. Alright. <laughs> okay, good to know. Um, well, I could also use black stained glass. Anyways, so no quartz slabs. Let's make a couple. Alright. Uh, and I'll fix the holes first. This is the middle of the room. I wanted to put in some gold blocks here, but maybe just one and not right now because I feel too lazy to go grab it. Alright. Any more holes around here that I need to take care of? This one. That's pretty much it. Was there a torch? there all right also i guess i went all around with those i i finished the first level i didn't realize i was this far into the hall of rewards being finished god damn all right oh god w way more slabs needed to finish this so let's do two stacks and maybe this is enough to finish the floor completely. All right, let's break it all down. All the way over, God, uh, I think I might need more quartz slabs than I thought. Actually, by, by the way, Jesus, this is huge. This room is massive why is there a random quartz slab over there i must have put it in now when i was fixing the holes all right let me oh god he scared me dude his noises are gonna scare me for a while i'm not used to having him here oh i hear a drowned ah he's got nothing in his hand useless Alright. Ah, fuck, of course. This always happens. Alright, at least the sea lanterns don't get popped accidentally when I... When I just look at them. While I do this. So there's that. How much time does it take for a polar bear to grow in Minecraft? I wonder. Oh, I just wanted to dump some stuff. But of course, all of my chests are full. Alright. Let's finish the floor. And then I'll do the second uh, second floor of uh, pillars and stuff like that, probably. Or should I ah should I cover the like because I don't have those. Oh, I stopped here with the pillars, so I don't only. All right, all right. I I know what to do. I'm gonna finish this first level here completely, hopefully, with the quartz I brought over. If it lasts, but I'm kind of using a lot. But yeah, I'll be able to make way more quartz. With those cured um, stonemasons now, if I cure them a bit more, I could just trade in all my stone for emeralds and turn stone to quartz, basically. That would be pretty cool. And it will also help me get rid of all of this random ass uh, stone that I have I even have a stone generator so it's that easy to get uh, emeralds once you start curing villagers you can literally make a stone generator 
and trade that stone to a stonemason. One, one for one if you cured him enough. That's kind of crazy. Alright, so... Where was it? Over here. Alright. Is another stack of quartz slabs enough? I don't think so. But we're gonna find out. Oh, did he grow up? Oh, look at him. He grew up. Hey, big boy. I still can see your name through the glass, which is unfortunate. Mm. Oh my god. Alright, there we go. Guardian. Hey! He kind of wants to murder me, doesn't he? And his his face is a bit over in the wall. I wanted to see if he would like get up on his two feet to try and attack me, but I guess he can't. Oh, he knows I'm his... I was gonna say father, but <laughs> that's messed up. Oh, he's cool. Alright, alright. Nice. Okay, don't breathe nasty at me, please. <sighs> I I do kind of want to put uh, a release mechanism on his uh, glass box. I don't know why exactly. It's not like it's he's ever going to be released. Unless I could have him fight monsters. He's going to kill monsters, right? Like if I let a zombie or something spawn in here and release him, he's going to go get them. Alright, I'm I'm a bit worried about him dying though, because can you heal uh, the polar bear if you like I wish I could heal him with some food or something. The fuck is that there? Why do I have those stairs here? What the fuck was that? So weird. Anyways. Let's get back to work. All right, all right, we're doing this here. Oh wow, I can't believe I've, I've gone so fast without making any mistakes yet. It's gonna happen pretty soon. No way around it. I also need uh, those blocks on the sides, I need to dig them out. Holy fuck, how am I not... I'm running out of quartz just by doing this. Why did I think I have a lot of quartz? Those stacks were just barely enough for the floor. I mean, I can finish the floor, but I didn't expect to like use up all my quartz. Just fuck. Just for that. Oh, the chill vibes though, from the Minecraft music. Da, 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 da. I need some jukebox in here, like some really good tracks. I need to get the big step volume. I think I found a... Um, what's it called? A bastion, right? When I was looking for the magma blocks. But I don't know if it's the same bastion that I explored the first time around uh, like in the first world I think I explored two bastions and I don't know if it's one of those or not I mean I know it's not the first one but is it my my second bastion that I found or is it the third one I could go to it but I don't feel like dying right now <laughs> so maybe maybe someone if if you find me going to a bastion in any day in this Minecraft world, that means I kind of want to die. And this day certainly started out that way with me kind of wanting to die. <laughs> but now that I've, I've brought over the polar bear, I don't want to die anymore. I kind of wanted to, to die just, just because I have so much work to do. And I don't feel like doing it. 
but if I if I do die, it's just gonna be it's just gonna mean even more work, right? Because I still have to do all of this back up again. Yeah, I don't know. I I remember. You know what? Uh, from from that uh, first death in the bastion, uh, there's the thumbnail on the on the video that's like uh, haunting me, <laughs> right? Like when I look on the, on the YouTube channel at the uh, what's it called the playlist, right? And I see the last video, and it's the thumbnail with the fire and the the piglin brutes, <laughs> and I can see it right now as well in my mind. It just it stuck with me. All right. I'm almost out of quads and I've only done slabs. I cannot believe this shit. I was thinking I'll do the pillars here too. And maybe even the like roofs or arches, whatever. But clearly I don't have enough quads for that. I could go invisible, I think. But that's super dangerous. Like, I could go invisible to avoid having to fight the piglin brutes. But it's dangerous because there's a whole... There's a lot of holes in the bastion, right? And there's lava. So it's made specifically so you fall in lava. And if you fall in lava, lava with no armor... Oh, maybe... Maybe fire resistance so how good is a fire resistant potion if you don't have armor on with protection that's that's the question if a fire resistant potion makes me completely Im immune to lava even without armor then it's perfect all right let's get pillars now and where do i have to put them in over here because i i just drink a potion of uh, fire resistance, a potion of invisibility, and you know, I can explore the bastion safely. I really want a big step uh, disc or whatever. And if I get it, I'm gonna, I don't know, I'm gonna fucking carry it around and play it everywhere I go. I'll probably get bored of it, not gonna lie. But I have not heard it in a while, so. It's gonna be good. The first time I listen to it, it's gonna be really good. Okay, so I finished the pillars over here. But I have some more, so let's... Let's go to the second floor. Actually, over here. Oh, I forgot to sleep. I hope everybody is okay up. <laughs> Fuck my life. If those guys turn back into zombie villagers or some shit from a drown. What did you do, man? <laughs> Alright, so where would another pillar be here? Yeah, I mean, I, I kind of carry that around everywhere too. Did you put it under you when you were falling or something? <laughs> This is getting interesting. You went in the weather in the nether with your bed. And what happened? Ah fuck. I fell in. Also, how come like isn't protection for your portal the first thing you build man when you go into the nether, don't you? Don't you cover up that portal so it can be blown? Am I doing the right thing here just by building those pillars? 
I don't know what I should do next. Right, the arches, the pillars, or what? Let's do some arches until I finish my quartz. So, to light it back up. Oh my god, that actually works. Because yeah, the explosion of the bed sets things on fire, but I didn't realize you could set fire to your portal like that. I tried to carry a flint and steel on me when I go to the nether, but... Yeah, sometimes you forget or don't have it on you. Big brain play indeed, dude. Congrats. Also, just cover up that portal so it doesn't get blown by gas. Alright. Over here. Over here. All the way over here. Oh god, I have another full stack of slabs. Gonna be a while while I go to all of... Alright, let's tear this down. I don't know what I did here, but clearly I don't need it anymore. I don't remember why I built that. Or where I went with it. Somewhere up, but I'm not sure. Alright, over here, I guess. Well, I'm not gonna run out of slabs, I think. I have more slabs than I need. Alright, alright. And then go here. Fuck! I was so close and I fell down. So close to the finish. No. Nope. And this time I jumped down. Even though I knew I had one more to do. Alright, so I did all of this. Uh, do I do the second level now? With the rest of the slabs. I don't... I Can I even do it? No, I don't have the, the bricks in place. Alright, so I have some extra slabs. I'll just keep them for now. Let's put these blocks in. Where am I supposed to put them? Over here? Right, like this. All the way around. I have to move those. God, I have so much work to do. And I've been so lazy lately. Like, thinking right now about how I cleared this whole room is actually insane to me. Look, look how much space I've made. All of this. The fucking... I was working hours a day to get this done and right now I can barely bring myself to work on it <laughs> while on stream never mind spending hours off stream just to get progress done I don't know why I'm so over it right now I just feel like playing league lately and I feel kind of bad that I'm not streaming league yet I really wanna like since I'm playing so much anyway so I'm playing like a couple more hours of league after the stream. I want it to at least be on stream. But that's gonna happen pretty soon since I got most of the PC parts. Is it too big? Uh, the, the room here, the project? I think it's fine. Like, uh, if it was smaller it wouldn't be too much of a challenge or too impressive. And if it was bigger, I probably would have just... I don't know. If it was bigger, either I wouldn't be able to complete it. Or uh, I would die before doing it. I think this is the right size. For a one-man job. And it, it might not be big enough, right? Like, in terms of... In terms of people viewing, right? Since this is a hall of rewards for the viewers. For now, sure. 
uh, if you think about like I have 200 followers in total right but I have only like five or six active viewers and I've made 200 spots right this has 200 spots it's too big I could have made one with five spots right for for everyone watching but if you consider that like hopefully the channel is gonna grow I, I call it a channel like a YouTube channel but it's a twitch stream it's different whatever if if the, if the stream is gonna grow right and it's gonna expand it's gonna grow past uh, 200 spots then this is actually too small so and that might be a problem like if this becomes too small it's gonna be a problem hey guardian how are you doing oh look at him yeah we're having a dance party no don't stop come on look at me come on dance with me yeah come on uh huh we're dancing oh only sometimes all right all right come on left and right left and right repeat after me come on uh true i i could die before i finish this i try to keep mostly safe within the mushroom biome and um, try to finish this but i've done some stupid shit that makes me think i'm gonna die anyway like i've almost died a couple of times and <laughs> and it was me without taking risks right i would die just falling over or doing dumb stuff hitting my head too hard all right let's check out the the villagers because i think they're all cured now and i really need to get one that um, gives me the light uh, wait what is it the white terracotta wait does this guy only have oh never mind blue terracotta i'm trying to see if i have any white terracotta that's not glazed but i guess not the black the sign ah god all right so i have to make more stone masons i really want the it's gonna be between the white glazed terracotta and the, where is it this one light blue for the ceiling of the place um like the plan is to have a line of black stone or something like this go all around in a circle then quartz underneath and above it the ceiling and the f the side walls with some kind of glazed terracotta right and i'm thinking light blue or uh, white white glazed terracotta i don't know what it looks like <laughs> not really and i don't know how the pattern is gonna work but uh it might make it cool i was also considering purple because i i really like the idea of purple but does it really work i feel like the blue would work better because of the water here although it might not i i would need some complementary color to the ceiling something that's not not blue as the water right something that makes the water stand out so maybe something different for the ceiling and the walls could be blue doesn't matter or maybe they the walls are gonna be something else as well but the thing is i really want the lake to stand out it already does right but i i don't want to put it off by having a lot of blue on the ceiling and the walls so yeah i'm, I'm looking for the light i mean the white glazed terracotta and i could use the light blue terracotta but that might not work anyways god i just need so much so much quartz for this oh there's some torches up there <laughs> i just realized anyway i should sleep but yeah i think i'm gonna stop for today because i don't know what else to do i don't really i i i expected getting the bear to be more of a challenge but it took me like five minutes that was super easy come on dance with me dance with me i like that he's shaking his head he's probably trying to murder me but to me it's a dance um and the villager thing i fucked it up um and i'm gonna fix it off stream because who knows how many attempts it's gonna take and how much time i'm gonna waste trying to put the zombie back in but yeah i'm gonna fix this i'm gonna do villagers one by one and probably tomorrow i'll be just making villagers curing them and 
building more of a an stonemason army or something. Anyways, uh, see you tomorrow with more Minecraft and thank you for watching.